Hi, I'm Keisha from carseatblog.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do a baseless install with the Graco Snug Ride 40. This installation technique actually works for any of the Graco infant seats, regardless of whether you have a newer Click Connect model or an older Classic Connect model. This is going to be installation using a typical lap and shoulder belt. You're going to thread just the lap belt portion underneath the seat belt guides on the seat and buckle. Okay. Do not double back with the shoulder belt. The shoulder belt stays out and makes basically a beeline right back to the retractor. All right, now a lot of times the instruction manuals for these infant seats that allow baseless installation will show you to install by putting weight or pressure here into the seat pan, but that doesn't work in real life because in real life you have a baby in the seat. So this is a technique that I've developed over the years when I did baseless installation with my own kids when they were little, um, and it works quite well, and the more you do it, the more you get used to it, and literally I can do it in most cases in 20 seconds or less with this type of lap and shoulder belt. All right, so with the seatbelt buckled, what you're going to do is you're going to grab just the shoulder belt portion with one hand. With the other hand, you're going to apply some weight to the seat. All right, and with each movement back and forth, you're pulling it tighter and tighter. All right, once your belt is snug, you're going to go ahead and switch the retractor to lock your seatbelt, go all the way to the end. Listening for that ratcheting sound, the belt is now locked. Feed all the excess seat belts into the retractor. Now, what happens almost all the time in this case is, is that your seat is way too upright. So you're literally going to place one hand here, one hand down here, and you're going to force it back into an acceptable recline position. On this seat, you have a red line down here, which states that it should be level to the ground as long as your ground is level. And in this case, that red line is level to the ground. And now my seat belt is locked, my belt is tight, tightly tensioned, and it doesn't move more than an inch from side to side or from front to back at the belt path. And that's all it is. So there you have it, it's installation of the Graco Snug Ride 40 without the base. Thanks for watching.